Okay, y'all, we here. Brown. Welcome to this version of Better Hoods and Gardens. I'm gonna give you a little overview of our project. Uh, we just passed our inspection today. We're ready to start insulating. So we'll give you a quick overview of, of what we got going on here. Okay, we got our, our newly installed three gang meter socket. So we have the first floor, second floor and the house meter. Um, the bottom of this wall was a little deteriorating. So we went on ahead and stuccoed it and uh, put the wall mastic on. We uh, dug up this the alleyway here, <clears throat> re-cemented that so we don't get no water in the basement. <clears throat> Our next video, we're gonna be uh, capping these windows. <clears throat> On our previous video, we showed you that we had poured the cement backyard. We did that. Here's our wall back here. The pipes coming out is our uh, exhaust. One for the uh, dryer, one for the uh, exhaust fan in the bathroom on the first floor. Same thing on the second floor. <coughs> Not back door. <coughs> Okay, we got our, uh, our fire alarm box here. Fire alarm box, as soon as you come in, this is gonna be the foyer area. We got a doorway here. <clears throat> come in here, this is our doorway for our first floor apartment. Doorway for our second floor apartment. Fire alarm. So as you come in here, you notice all our fire blocking up top. Fire stops all along the wall. So this is gonna be our uh, living room kitchen area. It's gonna be our kitchen over here. We got our pendant lights going on right there. It's gonna be our kitchen area. We have a corner sink, electric stove, microwave right there. Refrigerator's going here. <clears throat> we got our blocking up for our cabinets. Then we're gonna put 36 inch cabinets up here. We got our blocking down at the bottom so we can fasten our cabinets to the wall. That's very important. Um, if you look at these kind of outlets here, these are adjustable so that when you're tiling, your backsplash, you could get the box out so it's flush with your tile work. So <clears throat> we like to use those on that. We got our new electrical panel here. <clears throat> this is gonna be a pocket door. Closet. Bedroom number one on the first floor. Gonna have a ceiling fan in the middle, four LED lights around the room. New windows as our TV hookup over there. And a pocket door here also for another bedroom. Closet, same thing, ceiling fan, lights around, hard wire smoke detectors, fire alarm system. We'll come over here, we'll have a Stackable washer and dryer right here in our bathroom with a pocket door here. We love the pocket doors. They're space savers. Um, we're going to have a nice custom shower here. If you see this here right here, it's our fire stop. So you put the sheetrock in and then you spray foam. And that stops the fire from traveling. Then spray foam down at the bottom. Get your fire stops up at the top. So if a fire does happen, it's contained. And this happens every 10 feet or so along the walls. So let's take a trip upstairs. We got our 5-8 drywall. Let me show you this under the steps. So this is underneath the steps. We framed out under here to take the bounce out the steps. Put our fire fire red drywall on there <clears throat> we got our hits for our HVAC 
So they're up high. And our return is here in the hallway, central return. So that it'll do a circulation when it's time to uh, get that uh, that air flowing. So here's our new steps. We got our 5 8 drywall in here. Got to make sure it fits all the way down through the steps. Okay, as you come up, we're starting to back here. Once again, our fire stop, fire blocking. Okay, we got our bathroom here, another custom shower, toilet and sink. Stackable washer and dryer. That's our vents that you've seen outside going out. We got our uh, protection plates so nobody won't screw through and hit the pipes. So this is a small bedroom here. Closet. We got our new HVAC up top. The, the extended trunks can't be more than 14 feet of flex pipe. So that's running pretty good. Coming here, this is going to be our, uh, our living room. Kitchen area over here. You see on the ground, I got an island. We can put an island right here. We dropping two pendant lights there. This is gonna be our kitchen area. We had to back vent this because the kitchen's up the front. So that's our back vent going through the roof. We got our protector plate there. We keep these loose until after, after we uh, sheet rock. Cause you gotta take this off. So we'll glue that in on the final. Got our fire stops again here. <clears throat> so this is gonna be our kitchen area. This is our uh, mechanical room, utility room upstairs. We got it fire caulked around all that stuff. It's our plumbing and our master bedroom up here. It's pretty big. So frame is done, plumbing's done, rough plumbing's done, rough HVAC's done, rough electrical's done. So we're gonna insulate and then call the inspector back and uh, then we'll be able to sheetrock. So Better Hoods and Gardens TV, peace.